Some plants have developed sophisticated ways to know when winter has passed and it is safe for them to flower. They have found a way of remembering temperature fluctuations over many months and use this memory to regulate when they flower. This mechanism enables the plant to detect trends from the fluctuating daily temperatures and decide when winter is actually over. They do this using a gene that prevents flowering. Over the winter, this gene gets switched off so that the plant is able to flower in the following spring. The puzzle is to understand how this gene gets switched off and then how this instruction is passed into new cells as the plant grows so that this gene stays switched off through the spring until the plant flowers. Theoretical modeling of data from genetic analysis has predicted new mechanisms that could explain how this process works. These involve groups of proteins assembling around the gene to form Velcro-like blobs that help to prevent flowering. When the plant grows, DNA is copied and these blobs get transferred to the gene on the newly copied DNA. This is in addition to changes in proteins that wrap the DNA near the gene. The new insights have advanced our understanding of this memory mechanism by combining modeling with genetics and advanced microscopy. This deeper insight into how plant genes behave may, in the future, help us understand how other genes remain switched on or off, which is key to understanding how genes are regulated. It could help us understand many processes in living systems, including, for example, how cells differentiate and how some cancers develop. Mm -hmm.